Dixon and I am back with another install today for you guys so this hair that I have right now it is from sexy hair and as you guys can see they sent me a wig cap an elastic and this is the hair in the net the hair that I have today it's a 9a virgin hair body wave it's a 13 by 6 22 inches and 180 percent density All right guys, so it's time to install the wig. I've already got my ball cap going on. I've got my makeup on. Um, I'm essentially ready for the day. I just need to apply the wig. So I did go ahead here and I did just take my curling wand and just throw a couple curls in her. That's not something I usually do. And I did originally bleach the knots, wash the hair, and I went in just with some heat protectant um, on her. I mean, she is a body wave, but I don't really know how to style a body wave wig. So, yeah, this is what she looks like. And now it's just time to install it. Alright, so as you guys can see here, I'm just pinning back the hair and I'm just going to get my scissors ready just to cut a bit of the lace around my ears so that I can get a snug fit and my ears don't stick underneath it. So today I am going in with my Bolt Hold Extreme. And I'm gonna apply a couple of layers. I think I actually ended up doing three layers um, on this hair. And guys, let me tell you, I have been wearing this hair for a couple days now. And I'm absolutely in love with it. If you guys follow me on social media you guys would see that i've been posting this hair i am feeling myself and so far honestly the hold is really good with this glue all right so with the glue as you guys can see i'm just spreading it out i'm just using the end of my edge brush just to spread it out because you do want thin layers as you're going through it you do not want it to be too heavy and you want to make sure that you wait until the glue does go clear before you apply another layer or decide to put down your lace so i just take a swab with alcohol just to clean the end of my edge brush so it doesn't get too sticky and then i go in with my blow dryer on a cool setting And just look, even with the glue as it's drying and it's going clear with my bald cap, it's actually starting to look like I'm bald. So that's the look that you want. So 
So I'm just going in with my scissors right now and I'm just doing a couple slits to do it in sections. And I'm just bringing down the middle piece onto the glue. And then I'm just gonna take my edge brush here and then a actual comb as well, just to get it to stick to the glue and just press that in. And then I'm gonna go on my sides and make sure I'm able to bring that over. I swear I'm always doing something different every time because I'm just trying to find the best way that I like my lace to be applied. And honestly, I think this time around is one of my favorites so far. Alright, so now that I've got the lace into my glue here, I am going to go in with my little lace edge headband and I'm going to struggles. extra secure I'm gonna go on with this next one it's more of an elastic just to apply some pressure to the spoke here all right so I think it's been enough time that I've had these guys on. So let's go in here, start removing them. See if I need to keep it on longer. Time to go in here and get to cut in. So I know I've said this in one of my previous videos, but I'm just going in with my little eyebrow razor here. And you just want to make sure that you're very careful with what you're doing. You don't want to cut your skin, but this is one of my favorite methods on cutting the lace. I find that it cuts the lace very easily and it just gives it a different finish versus if you were to go in with a pair of scissors. You can't tell me nothing right now. Look at that. Ah, what lace. What lace. Ah. Just need to fix along where I cut where the glue was still uh, pretty active there. Okay, so I'm just going in with my blow dryer right now because I've already cut my baby hair at this point and I'm just trying to get everything to lay flat. All 
All right, guys, moment of truth. Let's bring this camera closer. Get up close and personal. I'm joking. <laughs> All right, so hasn't been very long. I already did my baby hair basically off camera. Yes, honey. Yes, honey. Oh, I love wearing a new wig. It always gives me a new personality. Okay. All right. I have never been one to like do like big voluptuous hair. Even when I used to just like put weave in. I've never been one to to do big and voluptuous. But honey, every girl deserves to wear curls. Feel her best self. All right, guys. So again, this hair is from Sexy Hair. If you guys want to save some extra coins, don't forget to use my promo code Again, this video is not sponsored. I did buy this with my own money or technically hubby bought the wig for me for my birthday. Thanks, hubby. But um, if you guys want to save some extra coins from Sexy Hair, make sure you guys used my promo code. It's going to be down in the description. If you guys like this video, don't forget to like, comment. And if you want to keep up with me, subscribe as I do do a lot of beauty vlogs well mainly hair stuff and a lot of unboxing hauls but i don't know how you guys feeling this hair i feel like a brand new person like look at that scalp all right guys again thanks so much for watching i hope you guys enjoy this experience with me i love you guys and again don't forget to like comment and subscribe i'll see you guys soon bye